Hey, it's DIY Doran. Here are the new coupons for Monday, February the 5th through Sunday, February 18th at Harbor Freight. All right, first up, we got an extended foot, extended dual foot air chuck. Six buck for that. All right, okay, deal. Here's a $7 air tool accessory kit, 17 piece. Uh, good deal there. Here's a, here's a nice sale on this basic compressor, although I think they have uh, a better one you can get. Uh, this 15 degree coil roofing nailer. That's pretty sweet. Underbox, good deal. Um, here's a sweet deal. One gallon. This is the Fortress Ultra Quiet. So I believe that means it has the brushless motor. I have the 10 gallon Ultra Quiet with a brushless motor. It's pretty awesome. Nice, quiet, powerful. This is the little one. Um, 129 bucks. I think that's a good deal. If you want something a little bit bigger it's going to be a, it's going to be louder and probably not as and well and not as high quality than mcgraw right here um you get a little more well yeah you get a little more cfm 139 here's a, a professional gravity feed spray gun here's the big fortress i'd like to get that some point a bit or like i don't know uh the high performance one is i get i don't think the brushless I th maybe they have a big ultra quiet. I'd probably go for that. A little bit bigger and an ultra quiet one. Maybe build a box for it. Anyways, enough about that. Here's some blade fuses. These are nice to have if your car takes these. Keep them handy. Six bucks, good deal. Uh, this thing th takes D batteries right here. This transfer pump, so I would avoid it. I have this body and fender set. It's pretty... It's good. It's got a good variety. Um, here's a bearing remover and installer kit. Only 90 bucks. Um, stuff like this too, you can rent for free at a lot of your like AutoZone, O'Reilly type stuff. You just you pay the price of the tool and you can check it out for like a day or so, return it, and then you get your money back. Um, so that's an option too. Um, Fifteen hundred pound capacity steel ATV motorcycle lift. So they also have an aluminum one, which is more expensive, but this one's this one's a good deal. I might get that. Um, here's a basic. Three ton uh, floor jack with rapid pump, the Pittsburgh. It's 120 bucks. Seems like a good deal. I have some of these six ton Daytona jack stands, um, and this, I like them. Here's a long jaw master puller set from Icon. This is their high end line of um, mechanics tools. I have these uh, shock cords, electric stretch cords here. Um, they stretch out a little bit easy. Um, not that good a quality. You can get better. Um, I'd probably just avoid them. Um, 500 pound capacity tie down ratcheting straps. 12 bucks. That's, that's a decent deal. Here's a big, uh, wheel chuck. We've got a ATV wend for 70 bucks. Here's some steel loading ramps. Only 12% off. Meh. This thing's pretty big, this jump starter. Um, I don't know, this is like huge. I don't know. I mean, if you want something like, if you're running like an auto shop, I guess maybe, or like a dealership. But even then, you just get the little tiny one, you can carry it. I'll link down below. I have the Gulu 4000. It's amazing. You can jump start like big rigs with this thing. I'll link it down below. It's on, I bought it on Amazon. It's amazing. Tested really well on uh, Project Farm. Here's a submersible pump. Here's the solar panel that's always on sale. It's a dollar a watt, 100 bucks there. It's another more pump action. Got some pump action there. A um, couple bucks off the the mo the engine there. Not a huge deal. Uh, these are pretty sweet. These Starbit or Torx as they're known. Six bucks for a nine piece set. That seems like it have pretty much all the stuff you need. SAE and metric long reach key sets. Um, <clears throat> these seem okay. I have the ball ended ones, um, and I they're all right. I mean, I use them professionally. I mean, I use them as a bike mechanic every day. The long reach ball ended ones. If you want a little more versatility, you can get those. They cost a little more. This anti shock rip hammer looks pretty nice. Here's some self adjusting wire strippers. I've not tried these. They do have uh, the Doyle. Uh, well, I guess the Doyle ones aren't self adjusting, but the Doyle wire strippers are amazing the um the the one i don't know they're good ones you you'll know uh <laughs> they have like a couple they have these like dies and stuff and it uh i don't know i can't remember what they're called they're the copy of the Kleins. 
tool set with case 130 piece 25 percent off there as a basic little homeowner kit only 30 bucks it's nice if you want something just like to have upstairs you know just for grab a little tools you don't have to go down to the garage um v groove combination wrench set so let's get a little more contact with the way it's cut um with the way they broach it but i guess to me it seems like it would make it less durable though too so anyways trade off there here's the icon precision snap ring pliers good sale there 49 percent off or 49 dollars 33 percent off if you're looking for those that's probably about the best price you're gonna get on those you know every every week or so or every you know couple, every time they have new coupons there's a couple different you know of the icon hand tools on sales so the ones that i need when they're on sale and if it's like 25 percent off or more then i'll usually grab them if it's something i want i was wanting to get so I just acquire them as they're on sale and my budget allows um here's the five inch cable ties i don't ever use those ones very very rarely usually i just use the eight inch ones they're a little bit thicker and they're not much more but that's a good price um i would pass on that headlamp these magnetic hooks are awesome. I'm going to grab some more of these. Only three bucks. So, yeah. They still seem a little bit higher at that price, though. I'd be, I would expect them to get down to, like, two bucks or something. But, um, anyways, they're great. I have them all over the place. You can bend the hook um, to what you need because um, it's bent in a little bit too sharp, I find. So, I just bend it out for a lot of stuff. And then make sure you screw it in tight. Maybe a little bit of Loctite on there. Or a dab of like some super glue to keep it uh, screwed in there because that little hook is just threaded in there. Anyways, I, I have dozens of them though. They're all over. I just have them on the side of my toolboxes holding up just everything. Uh, wrenches, whole wrench sets are on them. Uh, here's a six outlet power strip. That's a decent little thing right there. Uh, that flashlight looks kind of lame. It takes, I don't know, double A's or triple A's probably. So I'd pass on that. Um... 115 lumen wall security light Eh, those look pretty cheesy here's a basic little multimeter if you need one that's a good price they even have cheaper ones it won't have the audible continuity though which is really handy i wouldn't want one that didn't have it um because that's just a really handy feature continuity um and this has it they're proud of it too they advertise it right there with audible continuity um uh, here's a gun safe the super glue is great. I pick it up usually when it's on sale like this, especially if they have the bigger pack. But um, these are great. I use them all the time, so I'm going to grab a bunch. Well, I guess four. It says limit four. So if I'm in there a couple times during the sale, I'll, I'll get four each time. <laughs> I'll use it. Trust me. I use a lot of super glue. Here's some gloves. More gloves. Uh, I hate this style of glove. I have some really rough, nasty ones. But it does make me feel like, like a bull rider or something. Uh, or a rancher. Yeah, here's some pneumatic tires. Let's see. It's a penny cheaper if you get the white hub versus the black hub. $5.99 versus 6 bucks. So there you go. Smart person. Gets the, uh, saves the penny. Um, moving blanket. Those are actually pretty decent. These hand trucks are nice. I th This looks like a copy of the one that I... Or it looks like they're the same. The one that I have that's made by Milwaukee. Um seems to be the same there's a cheap garden sprayer here's the pressure washer that's generally what it's on sale for got a propane heater car canopy this drill bit set is usually on sale for $9.99 um this step bit set that's a good deal there this orbital sander here from bauer that's a good price right there i would score that short throw random orbit dual action polisher sander six inch 5.7 amp what a long name. Um, almost as long, about as long as the Bauer 7.0 amp half inch low speed spade handle drill mixer. So these are nice for like mixing up concrete and stuff. It goes like uh, lower. So uh, those are handy. You mix it up some concrete kind of stuff. Here's a little table, a diamond back. I've never even heard of this brand, but I rarely really look at these uh, tile saws. I'm just not that into, interested in tile saws. Um, when I need to do some tile, I guess I'll get a tile saw, but all right, these wire wheel cup and brush sets are great. I have some of these, it's a quarter inch 
shanks, you'll need something like a quarter inch die grinder or a drill, preferably a die grinder. Got some belt sander, sanding belts for the bower. This trim router, I have this thing, I've never used it. My, my neighbor says it's not very good. He offered to give me his when I pointed it out in his garage. And I was like, nah, I got my own that's still in the box. <laughs> uh, I have better routers now. Um, I got it super cheap. Uh, eight volt cordless variable speed rotary tool kit. I got this for like 30 bucks and I don't know if it's even worth 30. I wouldn't get it for 40. It's just not that powerful, but it's okay. I mean, I, I still use it occasionally. I mean, I use it a lot actually. I wish I had a more powerful battery one though. Here's some rotary hammer action. Here's the machete. I got that. I haven't used it yet. Canvas drop cloths right there. I have this putty knife scraper set. It's pretty good. Here's a budget ultrasonic cleaner, only 70 bucks. Clean your jewelry or whatever. Nice. So that's a good deal on this paint sprayer, 50 bucks off that. Basic budget socket rails. They're not that good, but um, it's better than nothing if that's if that's all you can afford or you don't have anything else. Um, but on Amazon, I'll, I'll link to some on Amazon. There's some pretty cheap uh, magnetic ones or nice uh, ball bearing detent ones that you can get on Amazon that are cheaper than the ones that they sell at Harbor Freight. The more the U.S. General ones I think are overpriced at, at Harbor Freight. They're like twenty bucks each, fifteen bucks each, twenty three bucks each. So you can get like three of them for that on Amazon. So I'll link to some good ones that I found. Metal .3 caliber ammo can, nine ninety nine. All right, this Hercules 17 inch tool tote with 19 pockets is awesome. I highly recommend it. I'm gonna get some more. It's really sturdy, solid. And the price is like unbelievable. It's I have one that's my handyman kit and I'm gonna make uh, another one that's just like, just for plumbing. Um, I may have to split that into two. But yeah, I'm gonna make one, yeah, just different kits for different things. It's really nice. Steel shelf service cart, very basic. Here's a good deal on this Yukon 46 inch wide nine drawer mobile storage cabinet with solid wood top. That's pretty sweet. You got a lot of drawers, a lot of storage space, worktop, only 300 bucks. Here's an end locker. That's a good deal if you were gonna get one of those, the US General Series 322 inch end locker. Some spring clamps, quick release bar clamp. These C clamps are nice. I usually get them, occasionally they just have different sizes of them on sale. So I just buy like eight of them. Uh, eight, I would get like, don't get just one, don't get, well, get, get at least two or four would be even better or eight would be even better of these clamps just cause you're, when you're using them, you're gonna need a few. So try and get like an even number, especially multiples of four. There's some lead-free rosin core solder. Not sure about that. There's some welding wire from Vulcan. That's their higher-end brand. Here's the budget Flux 125 welder and the budget Titanium Easy Flux. This one's Chicago Electric. So if you need a cheap budget welder, one of these would be a good option. Here's the little benchtop band. So I went ahead and passed on that. I actually got their big one for $200 used. It's their $489 wood bandsaw floor standing one. And it's, it's pretty nice. I've been having some fun with it. I love, love, love a bandsaw. And so I'm just getting that one kind of tuned up. I haven't done a whole lot with it yet. Um, pretty busy with a lot of bikes. Hey, by the way, if you need your e-bike fixed and you're in Southern California, give me a call at Dorn's Mobile E-Bike Repair. I fix all sorts of electric vehicles, scooters, um, pedal bikes, electric bikes, anything. Upgrades, Surons, electric dirt bikes. If it's electric, I can fix it probably. Uh, let's see, shatterproof LED bulbs, warm white solar rope light. And then here's this special coupon, 20% off all Predator generators, valid now through the 18th. All right, so that's everything. Check out my channel for more tool deals, how-tos, and tool reviews.